are better ways to keep cool. Call KS Services and receive a new Bryant unit with no payments and no interest for 18 months. Stay cool now and pay later. Visit callks.com for more. It's the Weather Extreme video. This is the morning edition. This is for Tuesday, the 3rd of November. I'm James Spann. Alabama's weather featuring a very cold start but a nice warm-up today. It will be dry through the weekend. The focus is on the tropics again with Ada sitting on the coast of Central America this morning. Let's look at the upper air look. We still have a northwest flow aloft with a big trough over the northeast and a cold start to this day. 28 for Aniana, Gadsden 30, Haleyville 31, 33 down to Alexander City. Demopolis at 34, and even down into South Alabama, we've got low 40s for Mobile and Dothan, but highs go back in the 60s later today. Still below average, but moving back in the right direction. Watch warning, Matt, very quiet across the country this morning, and obviously no severe weather problems anytime soon. That's the severe weather outlook today, and for us, it's going to be dry for a while. Big rains develop uh, well north and west of the state across the Great Plains and the Corn Belt, but again, between now and Early Tuesday morning of next week, most locations with nothing. Amazingly dry for November. Typically, things are active this time of the year. But boy, the tropics are indeed active. Ada is just sitting on the coast of Nicaragua this morning. Horrible situation. Top winds 150 miles an hour. They're just getting this constant overnight lashing. It moves in, comes through Honduras, curves through Guatemala, then comes back into the Caribbean, and by Saturday night... It's south of the western tip of Cuba. It's a strengthening tropical storm. So what happens from there? This is the tropical model set. Most bring it toward the island of Cuba. This is the uh, European ensemble, and you can see that most members bring it, bring it across Cuba and into the southeastern Gulf of Mexico. And, of course, we're getting off into voodoo country here so far out, but obviously everybody from New Orleans all the way down to Key West. They've got to watch this thing carefully as this is going to be one that's going to be out there for a while. And this is the intensity guidance. And again, you can see the numbers, of course, coming down, but then they start to recurve back up in about five days when this thing gets over water. And you got even a couple of models that don't show much weakening at all, trying to keep this thing just offshore. So a very interesting system and one we'll watch closely. Let's go to the GFS. This is the 06C run at 4 o'clock today ridging over much of the country, and on this election day, it's amazingly quiet. For us, sunny with mid-60s. Tomorrow, we'll be around 70, low 70s in many places, sunny. Thursday, again, low 70s, and Friday, mid-70s with a sunny sky. Saturday, another beautiful day, partly to mostly sunny with mid-70s, and this is Sunday, partially sunny, mid-70s. This is Monday, we're dry. We note Ada near Key West. Not especially strong on the GFS. And uh, This is a week from today, Tuesday the 10th, traffic north and west of the state. Rain approaching from the west. And again, Ada just sitting on the western tip of Cuba. This is the European. It's very similar. It's got the thing just over the southern Gulf of Mexico. We'll go out 10 days. This is Thursday the 12th. Again, troughing over the central states, ridging over the east. The GFS depicting Ada over Cuba. The European has Ada in the Gulf of Mexico. Wow. All right, it's the hurricane season that never ends. This is the rain from Birmingham off the European Ensemble. The models suggesting uh, the pattern flips to a wetter one out there at mid-month. Uh, the mean about one to one and a half inches. After today, temperatures come back up. We'll be mostly in the 70s through November 13th, and this should be the last frosty, freezy morning for a while. In fact, we could see lows in the 60s by early next week as moisture levels rise. And this is the CPC outlook for November 10th through the 16th. And again, with a high amplitude, it's cold in the west and relatively mild in the east. That's it for the Weather Extreme video this morning. We'll have notes on the blog. The next video here by 4 o'clock this afternoon. You can catch us this evening on ABC 3340 News at 4, 5, 6, and 10 o'clock. Thanks for watching. Have a great day and God bless. Never wait for hot water again with a tankless water heater from Plumbing Experts. Tankless water heaters are easy, convenient, and now more affordable with a no-interest financing for up to 18 months. Stop with the cold showers and wasted water and call Plumbing Experts today.